All right, talking about diverging lenses now. Um, so a diverging lens is uh, sort of the opposite shape of a converging lens, where in this diverging lens we actually have two curved surfaces that are curved towards each other, so you get this sort of hourglass uh, figure there. Um, uh, so this is a diverging lens. So what that means is that any light that enters in through one side of the lens will be diverged away from each other. So this does the exact opposite of a converging lens. Remember, a converging lens actually converges light to a single point. A diverging lens will separate light. It will diverge light. Um, so uh, similarly to the last video, we are going to see a couple rays that we can draw to help us try to figure out where an image is located for a diverging lens. Um, so I have drawn my diverging lens. This dashed line is the um, optical plane of the lens. This uh, straight line here going through the center of the lens is the optical axis. And we have our two focal points for our, our lens here. And we have our object. So our first ray that we can draw is maybe the simplest. We're going to draw just straight through the lens, just like we did previously with the converging lens. Um, we can just draw straight through the center of the lens right there, and that will just continue on. Um, our next ray that we're going to draw is going to be a little bit interesting, um, but we are going to work with this focal point here on, on this side. Um, so what we're gonna, actually going to do is we're going to send in a uh, array parallel to this uh, axis here, right? Just like that. And now to figure out where, how this light is bent, um, we're actually going to use this focal point and we are going to extend, um, we're going to draw a dashed line here, and that tells us where this light ray will uh, refract. So this light ray coming parallel to the optical axis will be refracted at an angle so that when you extend this, uh, this light ray here, it will go through the focal point. Um, so right away we can see that our, our rays here sort of intersect right at this point, um, and we can see that we can draw an arrow right there. Um, so this is our image and this is our object. We can see that in this case, our image actually shows up on the same side of the object um, and it's uh, much smaller. Um, so this is a virtual image in uh, the case of a diverging lens. Um, yes, there is one ray that is traveling through this point, but this other uh, ray that is uh, this, this sort of imaginary part here is intersecting with this, this ray here. So we know that this is a, a virtual image. There is another ray that you can draw that will help you sometimes. So I'm going to draw it here just so that you uh, can see what it looks like. But um, it may not necessarily always help you. Remember, you only need two intersecting rays to figure out where a, a point is. Uh, but there is another ray that we can draw where if uh, where we can sort of send a light ray through the focal point on the opposite side of the lens. So in this case, what we can do is we can, I'm just gonna start with the focal point. Um, we can draw this sort of ray here. And now this ray coming in at this angle, aiming towards the focal point will actually be refracted parallel to the optical axis there. Um, and so that light ray um, is another ray, light ray that you can use. I just drew this randomly, so even though it's intersecting here, that doesn't really tell us anything about this object, right? This light ray is not coming from this object. I'm just showing you this other ray as another option um, of something you can draw if you're looking for an image of a diverging lens. Um, okay, so that's how you draw uh, rays to figure out where an image is located for diverging lenses.